Hi, I'm Lieutenant Colonel Dave Norton. I am the 633rd Mission Support Group Deputy Commander here at Langley Air Force Base, and I am also serving as the Open House Director for 2016. We're excited not only to be putting on the first air show in the last five years, but of course, uh, this one is extra special because it celebrates our, our centennial of Langley Airfield. Uh, 100 years of, of active uh, airfield operations here at Langley, uh, which is the oldest active airfield in, in the country, actually. So uh, this air show really kind of kicks off a year full of celebrations that will recognize and commemorate uh, the 100 years of Langley Airfield. We have a great lineup. We've been uh, planning the show for well over a year now and uh, through that course of time we've got uh, not only our very own F-22 demonstration team based right here at Langley uh, that will be performing but we have the Air Force demonstration team, the Thunderbirds, an F-18 Hornet demonstration from the United States Navy, the U.S. Army's Golden Knights parachute team will be here as well and a whole host of other uh, performances, static displays, uh, to include civilian performers uh, with aerobatics and as I said on Friday night uh, some pyrotechnics and, uh, and other great things for everybody to enjoy. There will also be some, some ground entertainment. Uh, we've got the shockwave jet truck which is always a, a crowd pleaser and it gives everybody the opportunity to relax their necks from uh, looking up in the sky all day long and enjoy some, some ground entertainment as well. Free admission, free parking. Um, gates will be wide open uh, to the general public uh, beginning at 1700 on Friday and uh, 9 in the morning on Saturday and Sunday. Um, the, the public uh, should be planning to use uh, LaSalle Gate and the Armistead Gate. You can bring uh, bags in, but they, they just can't be large in size. So smaller diaper bags, no backpacks, uh, you know, no, no duffel bags, but uh, if you have um, uh, strollers for your children, you can bring in lawn chairs, you can bring in hand care. Uh, food and, and beverage items, uh, but just uh, be aware that uh, you can't bring a cooler. Um, th there will be food and beverage obviously available for purchase here at the air show, um, but if somebody wants to bring in uh, those types of things hand carried, that'll be okay. Pretty much no restrictions on photography, so cameras and, and camera bags are allowed in, just, uh, just not an oversized bag, so use discretion there in terms of how much uh, camera equipment you might uh, want to bring along. but. Uh, but generally, uh, all those things will be will be allowed in. I'm Major John Cummings, and I'm the air show director here at Langley Air Force Base. Over the last two years, I was the F-22 demonstration pilot for uh, 2014 and 2015. I performed the Raptor demonstration today. You will not see me fly at the Langley Air Show, but I guarantee you that uh, Major Dickinson, who's my replacement, will do a spectacular job. The Raptor demo is unique. We do. Uh, some things with this jet that no other aircraft in the world can, can really perform. So um, a lot of the maneuvers that we actually use in the air show are maneuvers that are used to teach new pilots what it's like to fly the Raptor. What makes the Raptor special is its ability to fly slow and, uh, and its ability to maneuver post-stall. That is to say the aircraft is no longer flying, it's just the really large flight controls and the thrust vectoring nozzles that are uh, allowing the airplane to point its nose uh, where it needs to. It's fun to go fast, it's fun to pull a lot of G's, and, uh, and of course it's fun to do it uh, for an audience of, of people that, uh, that are just amazed by it. So that's uh, to see kids when you're done it's, uh, and, have, and see the awe on their faces, it's very rewarding. For the last two years I've gone to a lot of di different air shows around 43 at uh, 43 or 44 if I, uh, if I haven't lost count. But in that time I've gotten to see a lot of different air show acts and I've been able to put together a spectacular list of all my favorites to come here at Langley. So we should have probably one of the best air shows that's, uh, that's ever been put on.